Uh, I'm going Brisbane by seven points. Jess? I'm going Brisbane as well by a goal. Yeah, I reckon it's going to be very tight. Let's call it a draw from here. Here's the voice of Jess Webster to get us underway. So Turner against Smith spin, wins it easily down the throat of Beams, but he can't extract it. Boston on the bottom of the pack is wrapped up. We will have a ball up to start, to start this round 14 contest at Fankhauser Reserve. We'll keep an eye on that one for you on Neefield TV. The umpire tosses the ball back in, falls to the way of Southport. Clayton with a little kick around the corner, not 15. Corbin, he's got Johnson in the square. Johnson kicks the first goal of the afternoon. Southport, 1-1-7. Lions yet to score. They're under pressure though. Ruse just a spear and kick inside. Oh. 50 and marked in space. And it's Noah Corbett. Injury wise. So Corbett from 40. It's a beautiful strike of the football. And that is Southport second. 2 9 21. The Lions yet to score. And we played around 26 minutes in this opening term. Finally, reward for effort. Picks it up. Handles backwards to Bell. Right up against the boundary line. Just. Long kick inside forward, 50, no mark there for the Lions. Lions now with it, handles backwards to Allison, has a shot on goal, and there's the first goal for the Brisbane Lions. Good young player, chips it forward. Oh, just went over the head there, coming back to Clements. Clements lets go from 45, chips it to the goal square, taken by Wilkinson, and Wilkinson, finally, a goal for Southport, their third Three goals, 11-29. Make hay while the sun shines, so to speak, as it's kicked inside 50. Oh, well done, Bailey. Control it down with the one mitt. Grabbed it at ground level. Handball to Ballandon. Ballandon straightens up and goes, boom. That's better. The Brisbane Lions with their second goal on the board. 3-12-30 to Southport to 2-1-13. The Brisbane Lions, after all Southport's efforts, Bob, still only 17 points, less than three goals. All right. caught, um, Ballenden, he wants to quickly play on. He's got a man in, in the goal square. And it's Buick, I think it is. It is, and he marks inside the square. Yeah, you had to pinpoint the kicks. Mays' kick could have um, easily turned over. He didn't quite hit the target, but it managed to get through. And Rowan Buick on the end of it. And uh, his confidence will be lifting after that knock early in the game. They've got the corridor clogged up. He's going to have to go more or less down the line. Finds Mitch Hinge. It's a beautiful kick. Hinge is going to wheel around on the left foot. Bastanax found some space. He's got a runner out here in Mays. Loops a handball to Mays from the point of the centre square. Diving effort, but it's going to drop onto the chest of Rowan Buick. So Rowan Buick kicked the last goal for the Brisbane Lions. Comes in and makes no mistake in the needful competition so far. It's another short pass and... This Dylan Fife just wasn't aware of that one, and Corey Lyons, just another 15 metres. Let's go from 45. Makes a liar out of everybody. Drills it over the goal umpire's cap. To play on, he'll send it back inside forward 54. The Lions, Archie Smith will have a go at this one. He can't mark. Ball spills at ground level. Buick for the Lions. Left foot snap goal. And that's Buick's third of the afternoon. And for the first time at Fankhauser Reserve, the Lions are in front on the scoreboard. Clayton wants to move on. He just evades one opponent and then throws it on the boot inside 50. Johnson's got a biggest, bit of space against Bailey. Used his body well. Throws it on the boot. And there's the answering goal for the Sharks. Just another opportunistic goal from Mitch Johnson. Oh. Pass all was well read by Clay Beams. Smothering effort. Got the handball away. They could be in attack again here. Brisbane, it's a big kick from Mays. Goes to the top of the square. Buick can't quite take the mark. Front and centre Sloan. It comes back out now. Mitch Hinge. Handball off. No. Wheels around. Left foot. Mitch Hinge. That was the one the Brisbane Lions were after and Southport were desperately defending. Oh, well done from Stasevich, who extracted the ball from traffic. Gave it to Allison. Allison from 50. Dagger. Here it is. Jacob Allison, his second goal. And that was his only intent when he got it and approached 50. Just drilled it through. 8 6 54. He's going to pick it up, get around Dawson, and then chips it into the path. You see, that is a good lead, and it is a good kick. And Wilkinson has kicked one goal for the day, 13 for the year. They need this Southport, but they've been wanting them all day, Bob. Tom Wilkinson.
from 45. Oh, straight! Tom Wilkinson! They're alive. They are alive. Southport with their first score of the final quarter. Back to nine points. 8 7 55 the Lions. Five. Six. Spills out now. Five has a second go at it to Boston. Just left foot kick around the corner. He's got Mantine in a bit of space. Right up against the boundary line. Measures the kick into the pocket. Wilkinson! He's marked. And he's quick to play on. Wheels around. Right foot banana! And he's got it. That is Wilkinson's third. The margin, three points, 23 minutes gone in the final term. This possesses Cox. Now Frost kicks it off the deck. There's Tom Bell, kept his feet, gathered the ball, kicks it to Tompkinson. Well done, Seb Tape. Oh, Got there first. Oh, goodness, that is a big call. Coming with the flight of the ball, Seb Tape. Well, he was a judge to have infringed on Tomkinson, who was eyes for the ball. Has a chance. Oh, he's missed. Oh, well, there you go. The old footy gods are back to play. One point. So that makes it 56 to 53. The Lions have overtaken them in the final term. Smith at the back. Ball in dispute. High tackle. Umpire has called a high tackle. And it's going to go to Chadwick could put the Sharks in front he derails it the Cabana Lounge here at Fankhauser Reserve goes ballistic and Southport against all the odds hit the front by a point still in dispute 30 metres from goal you could throw a hanky over 30 players and it is ticking down here. Southport by two points. Another throw up. Archie Smith, there it is. What a cracking game of needful footy here. The top of the table, Sharks retain their spot. Ninth win of the season. And this is a needful game for the ages, Bob Batty. What a ripping finish.